What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Sneaker Jacks here. I'm here to do a hat unboxing from the previous week, which we had a release from Lids, believe it or not, and also a release from Hat Club, which was the Fuji Pack. Now, the beginning of 2022, Hat Club has been coming out with some fire collections, some fire restocks as well. But then Lids has turned the table a little bit and has actually started releasing some pretty good collaborations and some really nice design in hats. There are some promising things coming up ahead for Lids. Uh, they had an Instagram Live when they were discussing on where they're trying to take the hat culture amongst Lids itself as a corporation and how it's going to start implementing hotter designs, a lot of more different colorways, and try to take the hat community by storm. But that's why we're going to start off with my first unboxing of the day. I make sure to cover my address so I don't dox myself again. And so basically, this is a release from Lids, which I'm still waiting on another one. But from this one, I think this is the Nationals one. They actually released uh, almost every Major League team uh, with this hat. And they also released two for Washington. One for the Senators and one for the Nationals. Um, oh, wow. All right. So this here is a Lids release. Um, a camel hat with 3M. Now, I've been told that the side patch here is 3M. As well, I may be the, the curly W may be also 3M material. Definitely the underbrim is 3, um, 3M material. As you can see, this is a woodland camo on the hat. We got the side patch World Series champion patch from 2019. Now the side patch does not have any 3M reflective material. Now the W does have it. I just tried it on my phone and the underbrim right here. I can show you here on my phone. The W does reflect and so does the underbrim. See, you can see the underbrim here. Looks like a gray, dark gray. But then once you hit the flash, boom, the 3M material. Very fire. This is the first hat I've had that has any 3M material on it. Frit really fire, bro. And then also the back too. The little um, Major League Baseball uh, guy here and the, that gray pops when you hit it with the flash as well. It would have been really cool if this was 3M material, but I could see how maybe, you know, that's kind of pushing it, you know. But very, very beautiful hat. I have a, a, a Washington Senators hat coming with the more of a rigid W. From back in the day probably have like a retro patch from the all-star game from back in those days but again beautiful hat definitely giving lids their credit on this one bro can't wait can't wait there's good things coming with lids lids are not just mids anymore it looks like but like i said they had to step their game up hat club was running away with it there's a lot of other um you know cap companies out there that were stepping up their game and it looked like lids had to do their thing and now we have our piece de resistance, pretty much what a lot of people came here to look at. This is the Hat Club Fuji Pack. Now I did hit on another hat, but it's coming in in a different order. It was, um, this right here was the Washington Nationals hat. And it, I ended up hitting on the, the pit, two pins that came with it. So let's see what's inside. This was a very limited release, but it did have a lot of teams in it. And I was very fortunate to end up getting my hat. Yeah, let me see that. Oh yeah. Oh damn, they gave me three pins. Oh shit. I ended up buying two pins and it ended up um, sending me an extra one. Let me see. Oh shit, okay. So this is the one that came with the hat. It is uh, the pin, uh, I guess with the lettering Fuji focus on that one that pin right there that's pretty awesome man I love the colors it's just fucking vibrant and fucking just amazing now these are the other pins that I bought uh, these these went fast but I, I did the smart thing I actually added it to my cart before the release uh, these were already available 
So I added these to the cart and once the hat's released, I ended up uh, pretty much, you know, sh uh, checking out with the hat. This is right here, Mount Fuji. With the flower eyes. And this is, I guess, more of a caricature, humanoid version of Mount Fuji. This one I like the best. Hold on. Focus, bitch. Focus. Hold on. Focus. That one I like because you could, like, you know, put it on side of the patch, have it sit on the patch on the top of it. And it just gives it a very unique look. Love these pins, man. These things went fast. These things are probably going for big resale, but... Like I said, I, I don't I don't feel comfortable reselling hats, man. I think I feel more of a personal attachment to the hats. Now here is the Mount Fuji collaboration with the Washington Nationals and Hat Club New Era. Look at that. Purple W, gray hat, black brim, underbrim. Love pink. Got that pinky. Got that pinky underbrim, bro. Look at that. And then we get the Washington Nationals RFK patch right there with the nation's cap with the Capitol building there and RFK Stadium salutes look at that A little pink and purple right there with the MLB sign side patch same combination black purple pink A little bit of white there Look at that curly W. You see the little hint of pink on the border there? Oh, this hat. This hat is fire, bro. I got I got another one coming from another team. So I'll post that on my Instagram once that, once that comes in. I'm telling you, man, Hat Club. Hat Club does their thing, man. That's what I'm saying. That's why their releases are so limited, so popular. And these things go quick. That's why that's why I like, you know, doing the live cops with tops on his channel. And on my channel, I did one this weekend for the um, release of the, um, what do you call it? The Great Outdoors pack for the Pacific Northwest. Love that pack too. Can't wait for that to come in. Now, in my honest opinion, I feel like Lids really had to step their game up. It seemed that they added a lot of people to their team um, in reference to uh, design also collaborations and colorways uh, and i think they're really going to give a lot of other companies especially hat club run for their money uh, it's just a matter of time before they started realizing that these other companies were making these different collaborations different designs on their hats and they felt and it looked like lids saw the writing on the wall they saw the competition just getting better and better and they're probably losing market share. So they really needed to step their game up. And I am very looking forward to the collaborations that they got coming up, the new designs, because at the end of the day, you'll be able to use your lid points for discounts on certain hat releases. So that's also a positive right there. But we'll see what 2022 has in stores for lids. Uh, maybe they're stepping up their game. We may, may step up the game for other companies like Hat Club or Cap USA. So which one do you guys prefer? The Woodland Camo from Lids or the Mount Fuji collaboration with Hat Club? Which one do you guys prefer? Like I said, 3M, 3M on the, on the hat. That for me is a first for me. But then the Mount Fuji collaboration with the pink underbrim and also with the fire pins to go along with it. Let me know in the comments below which one do you guys prefer? And see what other collaborations or what hats do you guys have coming up in your calendar to see which ones you guys are looking forward to releasing. But thank you again guys for stopping by. Take your time out of your data to come and see my review on two pickups I had, one from Hat Club and one from Lids, both Nationals hats. And let me know which one you guys favorite. And thank you again, guys. God bless. Be safe out there. Take care of each other.